pinfall, and it is for the World Heavyweight Championship. Introducing the challenger from Battle Creek, Michigan, weighing in at 235 pounds, Raw Van Dam. Raw Van Dam has come close to becoming World Heavyweight Champion on a couple of occasions, but he never got it done. One time, thanks to Ric Flair and a sledgehammer. I remember that vividly. Uh, close, but no cigar, Cole. But I have a feeling that tonight, Raw Van Dam is going to be smoking a big cigar. This may be RVD's night. SummerSlam, not to wrestle. This is Shawn Michaels' first title defense since winning the World Heavyweight Championship at Survivor Series. Yeah, this match should include Chris Jericho, and it would have if it wasn't for Scott Steiner. I thought you'd bring that up. You've become one big Chris Jericho butt kisser, I gotta tell you. What? Shawn Michaels had the will to win at Survivor Series. He had the belief that he could reach down into his soul and pull it off and beat anybody in that ring with him. And that's exactly what he did. He beat five other men. Yeah, but you have to admit, Cole, he had an advantage. He didn't have to enter that elimination chamber until very late in the match. He got to sit back and watch a lot of those guys literally beat the hell out of each other. Including Rob Van Dam, who was in that match from the get-go. Rob Van Dam with the offense. Collar and elbow battling for control. Great suplex that time. Bob's got a little bit of an ego. Into the collar and elbow tie up. Only one can come out ahead. You know, I don't know how much longer this storybook return can last for Shawn Michaels, especially after going through the brutal elimination chamber. His back to be hurting here tonight. And if Michaels can get past RVD, he would have to think Triple H is far from finished with his former best friend. If I know the game, he will not stop until he reclaims the World Heavyweight Championship. Man, did you hear that? Echoing throughout the arena. Connects. This is dangerous. Four. Rob Van Dam won a triple threat match here live last week to become the number one contender for the World Heavyweight Championship. And Booker T and Chris Jericho were the other two men in that match. And let's not forget Christian and Scott Steiner interjected themselves into the match. It was pure chaos. But when the smoke cleared, it was Rob Van Dam who walked away with tonight's title opportunity. Shawn Michaels is 2-0 since returning to action back in August at SummerSlam. Yeah, you're right. HBK's record is unblemished since returning. But he certainly didn't look like a winner when he was being carted out of the arena on a stretcher at SummerSlam. Of course, King, referring to the post-match attack on Shawn Michaels at the hands of Triple H. Uh, and his trusty sledgehammer. Of course, that was one of the most brutal attacks I have ever seen. The crowd absolutely loves Rob Van Dam. Whoa, and down he goes. Uh-oh, uh-oh. 
What a move! Good lord, look at the fire in his eyes! Ooh. Great reversal! Look at those eyes! And he's rolling. Well, I have, well, that didn't work. Boy, there's no way. Whoa! Good grief! Uh-oh, trying to put him away. Well, that's only after then undisputed WWE champion Brock Lesnar became exclusive property of SmackDown. You know, when you think about it, Bischoff had no choice but to introduce the World Heavyweight Championship. And upon awarding the title to Triple H, Bischoff had some pretty flat words for the game, claiming that if he had signed it the Nitro years earlier, WCW would have won the money. Rob Van Dam, whoa! Five-star frog splash to the back of Shawn Michaels. Can Van Dam capitalize? All he's got to do is turn HBK over, and this should be it. Here we go. Van Dam into the cover, hooks the leg. Who the heck? Hey! Triple H! What's Triple he doing? H is here! Look out! Ruining this title match with a pedigree to Van Dam! Yeah, but you gotta know, this is not about Rob Van Dam. This is the vindictive Triple H going against Oh! oh going after Shawn Michaels. Yeah, Triple H that has been obsessed with the heartbreak kid. Oh, now, wait a minute. Put that down. What? Oh, this is not going to be good. The game with that steel chair in the ring. And look at the way he's eyeing Shawn Michaels. He despises Shawn Michaels. He will not stop at anything until he ends Shawn Michaels' career. Sean is down and out here. Oh wait, look at this! Michaels firing back, big right hand to Triple H. Oh, right back to the midsection for the game. And now the game, hammering away on Michaels. This is turning into a brawl here. And Michaels never giving up, King. He's got the heart, he's got the guts, he's got the soul of a champion. Sean Michaels just will not quit. But wait a minute, look out! This is gonna end.